since programming and dimorph and today we are going to discuss about this datum plane datum plane we use this datum plane for creating any part for giving the reference for creating any part so in this datum plane we have so many option you can see here and the first option is infrared infrared option we use this option for creating plane as per our requirement and it's totally depend upon the our selection as you will select the plane will create automatically for example uh, if I click on this planner face it will come it will automatically select the offset option we can create a plane with offset to this plane and click OK now again I want to create a plane I have clicked over this cylindrical surface so this create at a specific point click OK now again I want to create a plane on this edge it will come on the edge and you can now shift it at any location on this edge or if I click one more face so it will come at an angle and you can change it by drag or by putting any value and this is the angular method and you can offset it you can also offset it first I have created a plane at an angle and then I have shifted I have moved it I have given the offset at 51 and click apply so this infrared option is most commonly method and it follows by the selection of our faces just undo all this and click the datum plane and in datum plane we have first this option at distance you have to select any planar surface and the plane will offset at a specific distance you can change it or you can reverse the direction or if selection is not any face you can offset your previous plane but you have to specify some offset distance in this method we apply distance click apply now at angle with the help of this angle we can create a plane at certain angle so let's start with this first my first planar surface is this and linear object is this and the angle will come with respect to first planar surface this is my angular plane and you can drag it and you can change the size of this plane and again same option offset you want to offset this angular plane you can apply a distance with this so this is my plane at angle bisect if I want to create a plane between two planar surface so you have to select two planar surface the middle of the just remove this object the middle uh, uh, the plane will come between those two surfaces one more time first planar surface is this second is this the plane will come automatically mid of this two plane with the help of this bisect we use this curve and the point and uh, we use this so many times so just click over the curve and the point and click over curve all are the curves this is also a curve just go and click the curve this is curve this is also a curve or click curve or just cancel this and I will go to 
sketcher handling sketcher i'm going to sketch a studio sp line now just draw a studio line click now i want to create a plane on this curve then we use this curve and the point this is my curve we have this curves and the point and the point and the curve and the subtype is point and the curve so first click over the point and then click over the curve the plane will come normal to the curve or you can offset it just reset and again I will take this one point with the help of this one point you create a plane and this plane also with the normal of your curve so these are some options and the mostly we use this curve and the point point and the curve this is the best option all are the same but the sub time the method are slightly different apply now let's go to this and here I'm going to use this two point my first point is this and second point is this the plane will normal to direction of these two point okay same as three point my first point is this second point is this and the third point is this the plane will bypass with all three points and the same point and the planar surface my point is this and the surface is this this is okay just reset this and again now I will use this two line the plane I want to create a plane and the plane must be passed with this two line okay with the help of two edges two line we can create a datum plane and it's very easy you can create again go and change tangent tangent I want to plane tangent to this body and six plane are selected just reset and change it to tangent and tangent faces single face select a single face single face the plane will like this tangent faces all the tangent faces will come or just select this Okay. one face with the help of one face you can create two point in the same option two faces I have already used this I need two face one and two the same will come ok now apply and after tangent through object through this on the planner face the plane will create automatically now you can create or this face or this plane same will work point in the direction so let's create datum plane and the option is point and the direction suppose my point is this and directional edges this the angle the angular edges so this will come like this just apply again point in the direction the point is this and edge a normal direction it will click or you can change it by here by two point first point is this second point is this the plane will come normal to the point direction on curve already we have discussed 
just go to the this now I want to create a plane with this curve, curve on curve this is my curve and the point is at the length of 196 millimeter now I will change this to ratio I want the plane at the middle of this curve so change this to 50 percent the plane will come or you can change this at the start or at the end and apply this and again xy plane if you have just close this if you don't have this planes suppose unfortunately I deleted this coordinate system then how you work you can go here and click the yz plane and you can specify the offset or just go and select one more plane and again xy plane the default three plane will come with the help of this or we have one more option just delete this just go to this part tab and select datum coordinate system this will create default coordinate system and default 3 reference plane you can manipulate it with the help of datum coordinate system you can create a new datum coordinate system and now you can move this at any any distance you want to shift this at any point it will rotate so with the help of this you can create a new coordinate system just delete all this plane and we will create some new planes click over the dot template and we have this view plane view plane will create a plane parallel to our view and you can create over this plane this will orient with our screen this is my trimetric view the plane will like this and this is my plane just change your view the plane orientation will change if you change the orientation and the plane will change so this plane is always normal to always parallel to our view our screen this is my screen so it will parallel to our screen and click ok and here is my plane now you can draw you can create any object on this plane thank you for watching and keep watching